Hello Virgo, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Virgo, this is your reading for the month of September 2021 and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid, okay? Also Virgo, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the videos. So let's get started now, Virgo. Let's get started. Spirits, please tell me what's going on with Virgo. Spirits, please tell me what is going on with Virgo. Spirits, please tell me what is going on with Virgo. What is going on with Virgo? And we have a Six of Pentacles, and we have is the Hermit, and we have a King of Cups. That's your energy. We have is Four of Swords, Temperance, and Nine of Swords. That's the energy of your person. Two of Pentacles and the Fool. <laughs> Fool. That's a mutual energy. So. Virgo, you may be dealing with another Virgo with that Hermit card. You may be dealing with an, with an Aries. You may be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sagittarius. You may be dealing with uh, Aries, Le uh, sorry. You may be dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Aries, yes, with that Fool card. You may also be dealing with Scorpio and Pisces, okay? If the sign pops up, all the better. Let's not even fix from the signs. Six of Pentacles, the Hermit, and King of Cups, Virgo. So, huh. what do we have here? What do we have? Virgo with that hermit card in the center and hermit represents your energy only hermit represents Virgo I just saw two to two which means uh, money money related abundance is coming your way and also let me tell you that the hermit is looking at six of pentacles and it has turned its back on the king of cups so probably Virgo you have a choice between money and love okay maybe you have got an offer from someone or you will get an offer from someone not that you have given up on love Virgo but what I see is that you're more concerned or you are you will be more focused on creating uh, your financial stability okay you will be more focused on uh making your finances good you will be more focused on rising up in your career you will be more focused on uh you know, uh, bringing overall stability in your life. Like with that King of Cups, I'm sensing, yes, uh, someone new and someone better is coming. Or for some of you, it can also be an offer from the past because we have Nine of Swords for your person. We also have Four of Swords, which only indicates that your person is thinking a lot about you. Okay, so they may think about coming back. But what I see is this person, the Hermit has turned its back. Let me show you your cards. Okay. Look at the cards. Okay. The Hermit represents your energy, Virgo. The Hermit is looking in the direction of Six of Pentacles. Okay. Which only signifies that you're more interested and you're more inclined towards your, uh, towards creating a financial stability, towards increasing your abundance, towards rising up in your career, towards being yourself, towards showing more generosity to, uh, to the world. Okay. Probably that is something that gives you that much needed inner happiness and inner satisfaction. And you do have, and Hermit has turned its uh, turn, turned its back on this King of Cups, okay? So maybe someone has expressed their feelings for you or maybe someone will express their feelings for you. And you will be, maybe now is not the time to accept the love offer. Now I'm focused somewhere else or now I want to direct my energy somewhere else. And when the time is right, I'll think about love that sort of energy i'm getting okay virgo so let's talk about your person we have is four of swords we have is temperance and we have is uh nine of swords like i told you your person is thinking a lot about you they are thinking a lot about you 
uh, are they thinking obsessively about you I don't know I don't sense obsession over here but yes they are they are thinking a lot about you okay and there, there is a relentless thinking that is going on why they are thinking so much about you first of all with that temperance card they are realizing that they had that much needed stability in their life only when they were with you they experienced that much needed inner happiness and inner satisfaction only when they were with you okay they thought that the grass was greener on another side and that's why they took a took a jump and uh, they they were experimenting other people also they thought that you will be there you will wait for them even when they are trying out you know other partners they were absolutely uh you know taken by shock when you moved away and of course you whatever you did you did it right right who wants uh, a person first of all who's going to throw breadcrumbs at you and someone who is uh, who wants a person who is going to treat you as an option and that's why you rightly moved away from that person right but now this person is realizing like how the hell or how stupid they were okay they are real, they were they are realizing that they were extremely immature they 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 are realizing that they were busy finding stones when diamond was already present in their hand okay so the guilt the regret and the fear of losing you okay is giving them sleepless nights and because of that they are thinking a lot about you okay and they are also thinking a lot about you because virgo you have taken a very strong stand you are not going back to this person you are not taking any proactive action towards this relationship which was not the case otherwise you were the most active member of this relationship okay you you gave everything in this relationship but with a temperance card this person is being forced to realize certain things that's what i'm getting okay they are being forced by their spiritual team by the universe by their ancestors uh, they are being forced to realize certain things about you and about this connection maybe virgo this is also a past life connection which has been which got resurfaced in this lifetime but what i see is that this person is definitely having sleepless nights okay they want to they want to restore that balance in this connection virgo but they but they are thinking that it's a very difficult thing to achieve you back okay they are thinking that it's very uh it is very uh not next to impossible but near to impossible okay they are not considering achieving you back is impossible but something that is near to impossible is what they are thinking okay they are absolutely having sleepless nights because they are thinking that they may lose you okay so the mutual energy is that of two of pentacles and the fool so your person is thinking to take a leap of faith towards you okay they know that you are not in a state of mind to accept them back okay you you have struggled a lot in this relationship and they are they are the reason behind your struggle okay but whatever the case is they are taking a leap of faith towards you another message i'm getting over here is that you are busy you are like you know uh busy making money with the two of pentacles in both of your hands you are juggling between different things maybe you are having multiple sources of income and you are focusing on multiple things in your life and emotions have taken a back seat look at this card very clearly okay this person is uh, busy juggling between these uh, pentacles right and water represents water body represents emotions but emotions are far behind right now the focus is on pentacles right so you're busy on your pentacles or uh, busy taking care of your pentacles busy making more money busy focusing on your career on your professional growth you have certain aims at the back of your mind virgo I can clearly see that with that two of pentacles you definitely have certain aims certain goals in your life and they come what may you want to achieve them is sort of an energy i'm getting 
okay and people underestimate you probably you also want to sh- like people have underestimated you a lot in your life Virgo and you are like you want to show to the world what is who you are and what is your potential that sort of an energy I'm getting and that is also one of the reason why you are focused on your money and your success right now yes you thought that you did uh, devote enough of time to love romance and relationships but nothing worked out so now you are like now uh, let me focus on money okay let me focus on my own growth and that's what I see over here okay you are very optimistic about your future Virgo very very optimistic about your future and I'm very happy for you okay I also see an energy where you are ready to wait for the right one I don't see you uh, you are in a hurry or you are in a you know you are making some hasty decisions no okay you may be juggling between multiple things but that is that is not forcing you to uh, you know take some quick decisions just because things are not happening in your life okay you you are definitely in an energy where you want to wait for the right person okay all right i hope this resonates hit like share and subscribe and comment on below children bye bye